guys. So you've just seen all the new rolling stock that I got. Um, not much of a layout update, so tonight I'm going to be posting this update for the Saturday and also a rail fanning one, um, so you guys have a little more to look at. Um, what I've been doing in my spare time, though, is working on cabooses, and now Atherin announced ICC cabooses, so um, we'll be ordering all the ICC ones that are Chessy, CSX, and BNL. I've also decided to start working on my steel coil and scrap uh, metal gon train. Uh, CSX used to run these. I don't know if they still do. They probably still do. Um, but I am actually building a second layout. Um, this second layout is going to have um, a small BNSF yard. Um, that's going to be my brother's, the camera guy. So when we go to build that, when it comes to updates on that, it'll be probably in my update. And if you want to go in depth, he will be doing layout updates for his locomotive yard um, on his channel. Which, when he gets his channel up and we get the tables up and everything, um, I'll let you guys know and give you guys his channel name in the description. Um, but until then, I'm just working on that. The scrap and quilt steel gone train. And I'm also, I've got so many well cars um, that are going to have uh, coil mounts in them because I found photos of uh, well cars hauling coils. And uh, we also will have a ton of coil cars themselves. So, with that said, guys. Here's the only thing I've really been working on on the layout, and that is the green unloading slash syrup or whatever comes in the tank cars. Um, this will be able to hold five uh, tanks um, from the end of this track all the way out here to the switch. It'll hold five. Um, there will be enough room for uh, cars to cross in front of them, and it'll hold five uh Green cars, so got two up front, two fit back here, and then one up here, and then the crossing. Um, the goal is tomorrow, or at least by the time I get to go back to work, which I'm not looking forward to, um, from behind this green building, um, the diamond will be reworked all the way to the mains. The main will continue and be hooked back up all the way on that end of the layout so we'll be able to run trains back here and then up to where the boxes stop is the goal to have the tracks laid I don't know how exactly my dad's going to do this area because this is my dad's all I know is there's going to be a road and then a track that runs along the road just like Division Street used to in Oshkosh um, which is where I live So, but I just want to do that quick little update guys um, Always not much to change, just new rolling stock. I still got a lot to pick up at the hobby shops. I got two hobby shops and a buddy that has a stack of trains for me. Um, but otherwise, that is it, guys. And then uh, look forward to layout updates, tours, rail fan videos, how to's, you name it. I'm going to start doing it. I'm tired of having you guys have no content. It's, uh, time to get start having them roll out so guys have a merry christmas i know you guys probably already did um it's after christmas now but hope you guys had a good one have a happy new year stay safe we'll see you in 2020 and uh christmas eve or christmas eve new year's eve um i might have a video up i'm not sure me and my brother are working on it i gotta talk to him so Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you again soon, and hopefully I'll have more done on the layout. See you next time.